Hey guys, Cam here, and for Android 11, Google has built a new tool that makes it easier than ever to flash the developer preview on your Pixel phone. It's a simple web tool and it does all the hard work for you. Before we get started though, just a quick cautionary note. As always with developer previews, this is not final software, so we don't recommend you install this on your primary device. It can contain bugs and things that don't work properly and might stop the apps you love from doing what they should reliably. Now this developer preview is available for every Pixel phone from Pixel 2 onwards, including the 3a series. So the first step is getting your Pixel ready. We're using the Pixel 4 here and to get that device prepared you have to enable a couple of developer options. So go to settings, about phone and now find build number. Tap that until you get the pop-up telling you that you're now a developer and it asks you for your phone PIN. Enter your PIN and now go to Settings, System, Advanced and find Developer Options. Now you have to find that toggle near USB debugging and enable that and also toggle the option to enable OEM unlocking. Type in your PIN again and hit Enable. Now your phone is ready and all you need to do is plug it into your PC or your Mac. If you're using Windows, you'll likely need to install a driver. I'll leave a link to that below. You might also need to select the USB mode from the drop-down shade on your phone and select File Transfer Mode. At this point, open Chrome and go to the Android Developer Preview Downloads page. You'll see a list of devices, so click the link next to your device on the list and it'll open the Android Flash Tool page. You'll get a pop-up asking you for permission to access your ADB keys, click OK, and now hit get started. And on the next screen, it'll tell you to do all the things we did at the beginning. So hit add a new device. And next, a new pop-up window will show you any connected compatible devices. Click on your pixel and hit connect. At this point, a pop-up will show up on your phone screen that says allow USB debugging. Hit that check mark to enable it and then the phone will show as being connected on the Android Flash Tool page. Click on it and then on the next screen it'll show you what it's about to install. So hit install. And then you need to agree to some terms before it tells you that you need to reselect the device that you want to install the preview on, just to make sure. Next you'll need to unlock the bootloader. So if you hit start on your computer and then on your phone you'll see this screen. Use the volume button until it says unlock the bootloader next to the power button. Now press the power button to select. Now the phone is completely ready to have the software installed. So watch your Chrome browser at this point and don't do anything more with your phone. Let the process run itself as it downloads and installs. Even if your phone screen changes to have that fast boot menu on it, just let it be and the process will continue. Eventually the process will complete and you'll get the final screen. Your phone will reboot and it'll take you through the usual phone setup process, like a brand new phone. Once that's done, you're running Android 11. So we hope you found that useful. Let us know if you have and hit that thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you again in the next one. Bye for now.